Hey you right guys, Trace Munch is Joey and today we are watching and reacting to episode 10 of Lucifer season 1. Uh, really getting into the season at the moment, uh, the last like say 3 or 4-ish episodes I'll say have been incredible so hopefully you can just kind of keep that up. We saw Lucifer show a bit more emotion uh, in the last episode as well when someone actually died and Chloe's still not being able to pick up on the fact that he's Lucifer. <laughs> uh, someone pointed out to be fair though, like, would you really question if he is actually Lucifer? Like if that was you, would you genuinely question it? I'd question if something's up because he's done some mad shit uh, since she's been involved. But I'm going to predict the finale of season one is where she'll actually realise it. So uh, yeah, episode 10 guys. If you enjoy, remember to leave a like. If you're new, remember to subscribe. And of course, if you want the early and uncut reactions to Lucifer, then link to the Patreon page will be down below. But for now, you like that. Oh, God! Really? Um, you have to bring him up now. <laughs> I mean, we were having a moment. Uh, Lucifer. Oh, my God. What are you doing? You're He's so doing disappointed. Right. Owner of oh, let's see if I can predict who did it again. You, you think one of us killed Pops? You! Your sister's here to see you. Oh, no, no, I don't, I don't have a sister, so it can't... Oh, no. oh. Hi, sweetie. Is this her mom, man? Penelope Decker. Well, as I live and breathe. What these Penelope two bang? Decker. That'd be really awkward. Okay. Hey. Oh, Lucifer, don't even Lucifer. think about it. Oh. Yeah, this one's tricky because there's quite a few suspects. Hmm. Investigator Joe will get on the case. I'm gonna say either the woman at the start or the woman who came over to him and was like, "Meh, meh, meh." Pops worked me to the bone. Her. I'm gonna predict her. Why not? What you gave. Yeah, he cared about his people. He was. Like a father to you, yes, we've heard that one before. He was my father. Oh. <laughs> this is Javier's son, Junior. <laughs> I don't work here anymore. Wow. Well, isn't that a coincidence? The plot Boy thickens. Boy returns home and conveniently his pops drops the next day. <sighs> Lucky bastard. <laughs> or maybe this is a I'm curious how, if we're going to see know, God <laughs> in this show. Junior is in. Well, I'm glad you decided to come here. But I'm not sure this is appropriate. Why? Oh, you shit. Your boss. Tell me what to do. <laughs> well, that's not how this works. I said, like, what? I to sleep with you, too. Um, I mean, if you, you go for it. Is that it? Um. No, no, I'm good. I'm good. What do you mean, you're good? Really, I'm good. What just happened? <laughs> so it would have gone better if you had sex with those. What just happened, I think. <laughs> on your mind, <laughs> These two. What's the gun? My number one ship. You know what? I'm done playing your stupid games. Well, you're not the one, you mate, because you'll continue to keep playing his games. I mean, I, I just can't believe it. I, I just saw... There's too many suspects! Generous killer, are you? Wanted to give him a little high on the way out. So <laughs> crazy. No. So generous. I'm sorry. Don't worry. I tend to have a rather striking... No, she's been poisoned. <laughs> Come on. She's about to die! Oh, oh my god. Yo! Oh my god, look at his shirt. I think she's a suspect. Or was she poisoned too? Or did she poison herself with a safe amount to know that she would live? Oh, I don't know. Perhaps someone who was kicked out of the family biz? No, it's not his son. It's not his son. Yeah. Definitely not his son. My mom is having this family dinner. No. You could really use a No, we're not inviting Lucifer and him. Board shorts. Don't know what more proof you need. He's deranged. <laughs> Fair enough. Fair enough. Come on. Yo, is someone getting banged? Can you hear that? Yeah, and since when has that bothered you? And dear old dad strikes again. <laughs> Yo, he's fuming. It's not funny. You don't think that... He killed him. Well, no, Jimmy he didn't. He to have one more we still have 20 minutes dad. left. He did. Detective, come on! Wow. She likes to ditch him, doesn't she? The only child actor I can just deal with and early. chill. Yeah, like, don't have to worry about we being annoying with this character. <laughs> no, look at these two just hanging out. Okay, Maze, this is so, a bad idea. They're fighting over what they want me to be when I grow up. <laughs> She's so cute. What do you want to be? Is this a Shirley Temple? <laughs> what? No. Trixie! Oh my god. Thank god you're okay. What were you thinking running away like that? What's your name? Mazakine. Mazakine. But you can call me Maze. Oh, that means she likes her. Thank you, Maze. I didn't say you could. <laughs> oh dear. You didn't kill him, did you? <laughs> no, he did not. Of course not. Hey, hey, hey. Oh, time for the awkward dinner scene. Can't wait for this. 
Well, if you arrest him, he's just going to lawyer up, isn't he? So why not have a nice meal whilst you get all the answers you need? Hmm? I'm certainly he'll open up. Yeah, that's some great logic. To hear him out. After all, he's innocent. I brought Junior here tonight because Detective Decker believes that he killed his father. I don't know, I'm just laying all this on the table. I believe. Just my word. Well, we might need something more than that. Come on, Detective. You said yourself you may want to kill your mother, but you don't do it. you want to kill me. <laughs> makeup on your daughter. No, because she uh -huh. thinks you're a child and forced her to grow up too quickly. No, we haven't decided. But things are moving that way. We just had the one. Great. So you're kissing now, right? Maybe that's it's a jealousy of Luce for going to kick in again. I'm sorry. What? <laughs> You know, he may have pushed me too hard and and tried to make me something that I'm not, but in the end, he made me the man I am. One well, a drug addict. Well, we are gonna need you to come downtown and make a statement. Please. Let me. I'm happy to have an excuse to leave. Oh wow, he's off. I hope you're happy. No, actually, I'm extremely disappointed. <laughs> Did you ruin dinner? No, because Junior. That was always gonna be a terrible idea. Helpful. So if Junior didn't kill his dad, why use heroin? To frame him, maybe? Yeah, I thought about that too, but the only person with motive got poisoned herself. Unless, Unless she knew used... exactly how much to give herself. Yup. Creating all the gruesome yep. symptoms, but without the finale. Oh, Yo, am I right? Am I right? Why would she do it? Yeah. Yo, if I'm right, again. Well, I was kind of... An hour ago. Guess who checked out against orders? Boom. Boom. Uh. Boom. I wonder where our lovely Susie Didn't call it straight away, but I called it halfway when she came into it. When I predicted my first suspect, she wasn't part of it. And when she was, I was like, she's giving herself the poison. She knows enough to use. Bruh. Because you killed Javier. I told you I would never do anything to hurt Javier. You seem genuinely upset. Like you didn't want no. Javier to die. You Don't tell me I'm wrong. Human. You meant to kill Junior, didn't you? Oh. What? He was still the favorite. Because he was worthy he's, of his, his actual love. son. And he had a chance of redemption until you ruined it. Oh, what? Why? Oh, yo! Okay! <laughs> oh, that looks fucking awful. That looks so bad. Oh my god, that looks so bad. <laughs> oh, don't show it again. Do us all a favour. That, that was scary. That green screen actually scared me. He was gonna leave you the restaurant all along. If you even want to. <laughs> I mean, if you want it now. And maybe I could rebuild it. With what money, though? Uh, hang on just a second. I'm surprised you came back. I made a friend today. Oh, she made a That's friend! <laughs> so, are you. Helen Trixie are friends. We need more Maze and Trixie friends. Oh, these two are gonna be friends, I guess. I haven't always been the easiest mom. <laughs> Every mom says that ever. <laughs> What's up, partner? What's up, partner? Awfully late to be calling a meeting. He's always eating something. You were right. Do you ever want to see me just not From eating food? Insane. Something's gonna happen. Yep. Yep. You idiot. No backup, nothing. That was amateur. Oh yo, is he gonna Oh to sleep? Oh okay. Knocked him out. I thought he killed him. <laughs> Let's give this a real shot. Let's not. Don't worry. Um, Detective, this is um, unexpected. Yes, well, of course, that's what I mean. But oh, what did the text say? We were even back together, and he ended it with me tonight. With a text. I mean, what are we, in high school? Yo, are these two gonna... Well. Oh... That I'm saying no. Yeah, because she's drunk. <laughs> For some reason, I can't. Because <laughs> it'll I feel right, mate. Why she's I drunk. drunk. I don't think I've ever been the son that he wants me to be. So you tell us every episode, but I mean, first. Oh, God. <laughs> For fuck's sake. All right, there we go, guys. That is episode 10 of Lucifer season one. Another good episode. I enjoyed that one. So it was as strong as some of the others that they've had. But I, my favourite scene was... Trixie, I forget the kid's name, but the, the eight-year-old kid going to talk to Maze in the bar. That was so wholesome. And then Maze is like, she feels like she's made a friend. That was so cute. I love that scene. I kind of called who the killer would be on this one. It was definitely one of the episodic kind of cases that they have. And as soon as that character showed up and she was poisoned, I was like, nah, she's given herself the right amount, she knows. So I got the 
suspect right but didn't get like the reasoning that she was actually trying to poison the son because she wanted the restaurant so that was a nice little more of a twist on it as well instead of her just simply wanted to kill the guy that died so the case was fine again it wasn't one of the best not even yeah maybe one of the weak ones uh, to be fair i didn't hate it because it kind of had the uh theme going on of like parents and stuff like you had lucifer and god stuff and then the son and father there where they had issues obviously and then you had chloe and her mum as well so i had a lot of like the the theme of parents going around in this episode uh i like that it wasn't so it wasn't actually the, the worst case i just think like cases like the last episode were way better because they just had better moments um and i like the character in the case the uh priest who died whereas this one i just didn't really vibe with the characters that they were introduced and so but they're episodic, so they're in it for one episode, so I'm not too fussed about that. Obviously, Dan tried to arrest this guy as well and failed absolutely miserably. I don't know why he'd have him be this close. You should have had him handcuff his arms behind his back. Then you should have had him walk in front of you into the car, make him open the car door himself and get into the car. But he was there walking with him at his side and then he went to open the door for him. It was just like, oh, you fucking amateur. I thought you meant to be a good car, but evidently not. So yeah, that was a bit dumb. Uh, but yeah, overall another enjoyable episode and Lucifer turning down Chloe at the end because he's starting to get more emotions and as time goes on so he'd feel guilty if he ended up sleeping with her while she was drunk and it wouldn't be right anyway so I'm glad he definitely, I'm glad that did not happen uh, even though Chloe kind of was confused about it, she's like, but you always jump at the chance, I was like, nah, well, well, you know what, Lucifer's getting his emotions and acting more human as time goes on so yeah, the, only, the worst part of this episode was that green screen for the fire, that looked, <gasps> Some of the green screen in this show is pretty bad. I feel like the makeup effects and some of the CG is actually really good, but then some of the CG is really bad. It's like, it can be either way sometimes. Uh, yeah, rating, I'm going to go a... I'll go 7.7 out of 10. I think it's a really good episode. Not quite as strong as some of the others that they've had recently, but I still really enjoyed it. So, yeah, there we go. I think we have three... Wait, 11, 12, 13. I think there's 13 episodes. Three episodes left. Uh, thanks for watching, guys. Leave a like if you enjoyed. If you want those early and uncuts, a link to the Patreon page will be down below. And I'll see you next time for episode 11. Until then, peace.